So we brought this Chevy Cruze in for a simple service, lube oil filter and rotate the tires. Seems simple enough, right? Well, some vehicles, just adjusting the air pressure, may require an activation of each sensor to relocate it or to relearn that sensor's pressure in the tire. So what we need to do is go to a reference chart and see if there is any special procedure in this vehicle for adjusting the air pressure or rotating the tires. And as we look, we can see in our reference chart that this particular vehicle says the air pressure, there's no special procedure, but however, rotating the tires, there is a special procedure in order to relearn the location of each sensor. So now what we're going to do is go to the relearn procedure in our book to find out exactly what the procedure is. It directs us to go into the vehicle and on the directional arm to the menu button. We're going to move the menu button until we get to where the tires are indicated on the instrument cluster. At that point in time, to enter the reprogramming mode, the first thing we're going to do is press the set clear button until we get to a menu that asks us if we want to enter that programming mode. All right, at this point, it, it is asking us, do we want to enter that reprogramming repro mode, yes or no? Just inside the directional arm, there's an up and down arrow. We're going to turn that up and down arrow to yes. At that point, we're going to push the set clear button. If we entered it correctly, the horn will chirp twice, indicating that we, we've entered that activation mode for the sensors. Now you can see that we have our left front directional marker on. Now the vehicle is telling us that it wants us to proceed with reactivating this left front sensor so it can learn exactly where this sensor is on this mode. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take our activation tool and we're going to activate this left front sensor. If everything goes correct, when it's learned, it'll beep the horn once. Always remember to wear your safety glasses also. So what we need to do is we need to scroll down the menu until we get to this particular vehicle. And now it asks us to read the sensor. That single horn chirp tells us that this sensor has been relearned for this location. Now you'll notice the right front marker lights on. Now it's directing us to the right front sensor. And then we're going to continue to the right rear and then the left rear to complete this process. Well, as you can see at the end, we had two horn chirps. That tells us that our process is complete and we've reactivated and relearned the sensors in this Chevy Cruze. That's it. This job's done.